Williams. I'm here at the Good Heart in Venice, on Venice Boulevard, and I'm here with a sick band from Boston, Prospect Hill. I've got Adam, the lead singer. Hello, hello. And Mark, what do you play? I play the drums. Oh, you do? I should have known that. That's awesome. All right, for people that aren't familiar with your band, can you explain a little bit about your sound, your influences, and kind of what makes you the way you are? I think we're really lucky as a band. We're pretty diverse in our musical, like, you know, genre itself. I think it, it's very broad. Um, for myself, as far as singing, I think we have a uh, Incubus kind of Faith No More kind of run, a little hint of Seven Dust in there, um, mm -hmm. with a lot of, like, underlying influences. But I, I, I think it, I don't know, it varies. And what, what about you, Mark? Um, I would just say it's, it's a real... Uh, melodic, uh, real hard rock. We like to change it up. We all have so many different styles of music that we listen to, and we just hate when a band sounds the same on every song, so every song we're trying to change it up and, and bring something new to the table for each song. Okay. So what brings you out here, just as a side note, all the way from Boston to Venice? First of all, it's a brand new experience, so, you know, coming up to the West Coast is, is definitely a huge change in the scene from the New England scene, um, from Boston, it, it's, you have a very, it's very eclectic, and you have a, a lot of inner city bands that just, uh, you know, they, they don't branch out too much, but mm -hmm. out here, you, you seem to have a lot of bands, they want to travel around the, the, the whole coast, you know, from LA to San Diego to uh, even further up to the Northern California area, and it's, it's cool that, you know, come out here, it's a whole different, like, demographic of people as well. So what's what's in line for you guys for this? Is this a tour? Are you guys just coming out? What's what's the purpose of coming out to Los Angeles? Well, the reason why we're out here is we got um, selected to be one of the, on the headlining stage at the Rock and Roll Marathon in San Diego. Um, it pretty much, it's like this big race that they put on and they got bands on the chorus playing throughout the whole course and then at the end they have a big stage with like every runner that's there. It's like 20,000 people and they come and watch the show. And we're on that stage. We're like one of the second to last bands. Really? We've played with uh, great bands like Disturbed and Kill Switch Engage. Corn. Didn't uh, you guys just play just, with Corn? We just played with Tell Korn. me about this experience, please. Here, here's a little thing. I'm standing backstage and I got a little nervous because I'm standing there. I look over my left shoulder and there's Monkey as he walks past me. And I was like, oh my God. Hey, hey Monk, uh, good to see you. And. Uh, uh, I'm, my name's Adam, and I, I'm playing right before you. It was an honor to open up for you. He was like, yeah, you were in Prospect Hill. And I'm like, oh. just <laughs> he, a little. He said, he yeah, said your band. Just a little nervous. And he, and he stood on the side of the stage during the, the set. And, yeah, it was, uh, and, and just to, you know, being a fan of Corn for so long, it, it's really, it was amazing to be able to open up for him. How'd the crowd love you guys? We did this, I got the crowd at one point during one of our songs called Breakdown, I was able to have everybody hold up their cigarette lighters and their cell phones, and it was amazing to see such a... Huge crowd, oh, right? yeah, it was nice. So, closing up, what, what can we expect to get from you guys? What's coming out in the future? Any of you guys working on an album, or what's coming out? We are working on our brand new album. Um, we have just uh, finished, actually, the recording process of it. We're in the process of mixing it and mastering it now. We are all really excited and about the anticipation of uh, releasing this in uh, probably like late September. Um, each one of us has put a lot of hard work into it, and it's definitely something that everybody will appreciate. Being sponsored by uh, Jägermeister, which is a great sponsor to have. Do you guys do you guys get free Jäger when you go out? Nope. Is that part of it? No free Jäger, oh. but we get some great merchandise to hand out to our fans, and mm -hmm. of course Jägermeister being our, our blood, my blood. <laughs> it's always a, a good uh, closer for an evening, so mm -hmm. uh, yeah. So on that note, we're going to do some Jaeger shots, and then we'll bring back the rest of the band, good and ready, to do another interview with them, and we can talk about where you guys came from, how you guys got together. We're getting all the good stuff in just a bit. And uh, thank you, guys. You're welcome. We'll continue this in just a second. Thank you. Again, this is Car Maria, your host for Real TV Films. Thanks for watching. Keep an eye out for Prospect Hill. They rock. Peace. That's at hand Back to the wall Tell me how we dance in the fall So take away the indecisions